Hey girls, welcome back to McStoryTime with Miss McMahon. Well friends, we continue to work on our nursery rhymes and today it's all about Mary. Do you remember Mary? She had a little lamb, its fleece was white as snow, and everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Well guess what, friends? There's a new Mary in town. And here she is. It's Mary had a little glam. What? She didn't have a little lamb, she had a little glam. Do you know what that means? A little glam, a little bit glamorous. She is fabulous. Do you see how she accessorizes? She's pretty fancy about what she wears. She's so glamorous. She's got a parasol, a fun bird on her head, some fancy glasses, the fancy outfit, the little lamb purse. She loves to be glamorous and accessorize. Isn't she fabulous? Well, we're gonna read about our good new friend, Mary Had a Little Glam, and the author is Tammy Sawyer, and the illustrator is Vanessa Brantley Newton. All right, let's get started with Mary Had a Little Glam. Look at all these fabulous outfits. Isn't that awesome? Mary had a little glam. Look, she's gorgeous. Love it. So fancy. Mary had a little glam that grew into a lot. And everywhere that Mary went, she wasn't hard to spot. <laughs> Look, everybody's noticing her. Look, because she's got such a fancy outfit on. Some cool pants, a nice scarf. A cool poncho top. She is fabulous. But on the day she started school, she caught some spy surprise. Sweet Mary shrugged and hugged her mom. I must accessorize. Look, she must accessorize. She must add more awesome things to her outfit. I think this might even be her shower curtain. <laughs> that is awesome. Then Mary click clacked down the block in a frilly formal wear. And by the time she got to school, she added extra flair. Hmm, let's look over here. What did she add that was a little extra flair? Do you notice what's on her head? A bird's nest. Awesome. Oh, and look, she's about to get to school and she goes to Mother Goose Elementary. So maybe some of her friends are some other nursery rhyme characters we might know. When Mary took a look around, her heart was filled with woe. That means a little sadness. The other kids in class with her were glamless head to toe. Oh my goodness, she noticed. Look, glamless. They were not so fancy, were they? Little Bo Peep, Little Miss Muffet, Jack and Jill. They didn't have fancy things like good old Mary. They were glamless. Oh, poor friends. What is Mary going to do now? I think she's going to come to the rescue and help. So Mary offered fashion tips. More pink, more beads, more shine. Look, just like her. Look how gorgeous she is. Woo, a hat for him, a trim for her. Go boa, it's divine. A boa is like a, a feather scarf, right, around her neck. So glamorous. Soon Mary brought out glitz and glam in everyone she met. The students, teacher, principal, and Clark, the classroom pet. <laughs> Look, everybody's glam now, even the classroom pet snake. I've got to top it and so fun. Now story time had gowns and crowns and mounds of striped chiffon. Look, everybody's wearing gowns and crowns. The art class, the art class came with glitter glue and trips to her salon. She even set up a salon. Everybody's getting fancy hair. So glamorous. Then Mary amped up music class with pomp and circumstance. At checkout time, she was sublime, left not a thing to chance. Look, she's even decorating Mr. Dewey in the library, the statue. Uh-huh. Good old Mary. 
So the morning flew, and soon it was the best part of the day. It's recess time, the teacher said, and Mary led the way. Look, she's leading all her glamorous friends to recess. Uh-oh, but all came to a sudden stop. Each kid surveyed the scene. Uh-oh, look, the playground, hmm, it's a little wet. It's, it might be a little muddy, a little dirty to play on the playground. Hmm. We're clearly dressed all wrong for this. Boo-hooed the 17. Oh, no. Poor Mary twirled her parasol. The crisis was a 10. She'd never figured out a plan. All was lost. But then, oh, she came up with an idea. What is she going to do? She tossed her shades and silk-lined cape, her scarf and strappy shoes. And Mary's friends were just as fast. There was no time to lose. The class raced for the jungle gym, the spiral slide and swings. Then Mary grinned and grabbed a ball, among some other things. So they took all their glam off just for a minute, right? So they can go and play. Flair for what to wear is better than before. True glamour often calls for lots, right? But sometimes less is more. <laughs> sometimes less is more, especially when you have to play on the playground and get dirty, right? She's still glamorous. Look, she still has her, her bird nest on her head. She's still glamorous, even with a little less flair. All right, and that is our story of Mary had a little glam. All right, little glams. I'm so glad you came to listen today. Well, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.